So the Holliston Agricultural Commission um, promotes Holliston Farms Day. Um, our role in the community is to support um, our right to farm, but also promote commercial agriculture within Holliston. So in addition to being the chair of the Holliston AgCom, um, I also own Broadhill Lavender Farm. Our farm was established in 2018 and we have approximately a thousand plants uh, in bloom. We use the lavender in a lot of our products that we sell um, at farmers markets and then also at local stores such as the Grapevine and Gracefully Restored Home. Today is Holliston Farms Day. It's been an incredible day. It feels like a grand opening day for us since we opened in November of 2020. It, we didn't really have a grand opening. We had a soft opening that kind of just went on and then we were just open for business. Today, from the very start at 10 a.m. in the morning, our parking lot has been full. Um, everyone's been coming out, learning about bees. I've extracted honey three times today in front of people to show them what it takes to extract honey. We've sampled honey all day. We've done samplings of all other products that we carry. It's awesome. Everyone's been coming out, been a great showing of community support. I'm really happy to have been able to interact with the community like we have been, um, giving out free popcorns, giving ice cream out, and, and more. Oh, it was, it was really steady and busy today. We had pumpkin painting, we had face painting, uh, we had a banjo player. Uh, the banjo player was a, a young fellow that used to work for us here on the farm. Um, so he came back to, to play the banjo. He self-taught himself the banjo. So he was here playing for two, three hours. Uh, we had the My FM Street Team here. Uh, obviously lots of old tractors and a couple of newer tractors for the kids to all get on and play on and, and check out. Um, and other than that, just having a little bit of fun. Peas Love and Parsley and we're both out of Holliston um, and we are selling planters today, small planters all the way up to large planters. Um, we are a seed to table garden experience so we help people plant their gardens or create a space that may not have had a garden before and walk them through the whole garden season of planting to all the way to recipes. It's been a really fun day out here. It's beautiful weather. We've had a lot of kids come through and plant in the kid planters. Um, and it's been really great to just meet people and talk about gardens, our favorite thing. Hi, today we are um, doing some pony rides and we are selling cider donuts and some apple cider and we have a bake sale going on um, as a fundraiser for our IEA team at the farm trying to generate some funds so that we can help our girls run their horse show. We have a great turnout, as you can see. Uh, the pony rides will be going all day until four. And um, we're looking to kind of promote our IEA team and let people know what it's all about so that we can try and build our team for next year. Things are going great. As you can see, there's so many people, um, people of all ages, bunch of families. Um, so basically what's happening is it's called Farm Day and we welcome the town to support um, the small business outposts. We have activities, free activities like apple pressing um, to make some fresh apple cider. We also have corn tasting and pumpkin painting. Um, we also make fresh ci um, apple cider donuts which are fantastic. There's, I've been, all day I've been helping out with the turkey dogs, turkey burgers, and there's a lot of people to come support and we really appreciate it. Yeah.